to give you seven last words. And I honor my pulpiteers, as I've heard that before. And of course, the man of God and our first lady, everyone assembled here today and by way of social media. So turn with me to John 19, verse 28. And I will be coming from the New Living Translation. Thirsty like a hey, who climbed the tree to see and hear. 
Hey guys, I'm in the house. Come on, uh, come in the room. Yeah.
After Jesus had said, it is finished, he spoke his seventh and last statement on the cross. Father, into thy hand I commend my spirit. Seven meaning completion and perfection, all at the same time. Right. Commend means to entrust or to put yourself in the hands of another with confidence. It means to take or place ourselves in somebody else's key. And Jesus did that to the Father without hesitation. Amen? He knew that when he committed his spirit to God, he had placed himself in the very best of hands. In the scripture prior to, in verses 44 and 45, it said from the sixth to the ninth hour, the sun even refused to shine. There was a darkness that came upon the entire earth, not just in Jerusalem, in Judea, Samaria, but in the outermost part. The entire earth was filled with darkness. In the middle of the day where the sun should have shined its brightest, there was a three hour Eclipse, a protest, amen, if you will. And it says that the veil of the temple was torn into from the top, showing God's authority, all the way down to the bottom. So we had authority over the heavens and the earth, amen. And why? Because Jesus signified that Jesus was saying that there no longer needs to be a separation between God and man. The veil has been removed. And Yeah. <laughs> 
in blame. You see, he was a wounded wise and transgression. <laughs>
lose fear. Just worry about your soul. Amen. You don't want to be like that man on the call. Amen. Don't tell him to come on down. <laughs> Save yourself. Amen. You want to get saved. Amen. 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 If everyone is satisfied with that salvation, amen. You can be seen. Amen. If not, we have time.